guys welcome to my laundry room this is a room that you guys haven't seen yet um, I know we still haven't done a, a home tour which hopefully we will get that taken care of but if you saw my last video um, you saw that I did some shopping at Dollar Tree and at Walmart to get some uh, organization things for uh, my laundry room because my laundry room closet is a little out of control so I'm gonna go back out and come back in and just kind of give you a quick tour of the laundry room and then I'm gonna show you my laundry room closet okay. so I really don't know the best way to film this <laughs> but uh, my floors are dirty I've got laundry going right now um, of course here's the washer and dryer um, this is a um, a window you guys saw me chalk paint this in a video that I'll link up in the description uh, up in the icon here um, and this is just an old wreath that we've had. But anyway, um, this is where I'm keeping my uh, things that I'm currently using to wash all my clothes. And then here is the laundry room closet. And when you open it, this is what it looks like. So you can tell there was a small attempt in organization. I've got, uh, I'm using this. This is a 31 uh, organization thing that my mom gave me. I keep my um, Norwex cloths and dusting mitts. That's a uh, mop pad. And I keep some other things. These are some uh, microfiber cloths that I picked up from uh, Harbor Freight. Uh, but that's where I keep my cleaning cloths. And then, as like I said, in here you can see that I do have some bins. There's been a small attempt, but uh, here is my ironing board, like I told you about. I have to take that out to get to the other things. So. Uh, we're just gonna get this organized today, so let's get to it. First things first, I'm gonna get that ironing board out of the closet. I took off my little decorative item that I have there, and those command strips, taking those off, they always scare me. I'm afraid I'm gonna get hit. Anyway, once I get that off, I put on the organizer that I purchased at Walmart, which I will leave a link for that in the description box below if I can find it. You guys, it was so easy to assemble, so easy to install, and I'm so happy to have that ironing board out of the closet. Once that's done, I go ahead and start taking everything out of the closet. That way I can see what I have and group like items together. you what this stuff is so um, my shelves are empty except for these uh, this is just some extra uh, hand soap that I keep on hand uh, down here we have our toilet paper here we have our uh, paper towels and then in these drawers of course this is my rainbow thingy I don't know what you call it um, and here I have this is just some extra laundry stuff in here I have uh, extra um, toothpaste and then down here I have a bunch of tea towels and so I've got my mop bucket this is my dusting one from Norwex my mop my uh, Norwex dusting mop is right here so you can't even see me so some of the stuff I was already able to eliminate I like to keep my bathroom cleaners in the bathroom just to keep cleaning the bathroom more convenient so they were in here so uh, then they weren't supposed to be so I took them to the bathrooms and then I have two bottles of the wood for good uh, cleaner by method and so um, one of them is for upstairs the other one I just took down to the basement to keep to clean um, the office and schoolroom area so now I'm going to try to get the rest of this under control Okay, 
Okay, I wish the lighting was a little bit better, but this is progress so far. Um, I think it's looking good. Now I just need to do something with uh, the mop, my wand, and this thing here. We're gonna figure it out. In my Walmart haul, I showed you guys that I purchased some command hooks, but the hooks were not big enough to hold any of the things that I had planned for it. So I am just using a nail, popping those in the wall, and then I'm hanging my dusting wand, my mop, and then you'll also see that I um, hang my superior mop system by Norwex on the other wall. I do use one of those command hooks to hang the mop pads close to the mop system, which to me just makes sense to have everything that goes together, together. Okay, so here is the finished product. I've got my iron and my ironing board on the door. I love how my ironing cover, ironing board cover looks with my paint colors. <laughs> um, you open this up. Ah. Okay, so of course we already had this here. I've got, like I said, I've got my cleaning cloth, some of my sponges. Um, I've got my command strips there, and then all of my other cleaning uh, cloths. And now I've got everything a little more together and I've got my mop hanging up I've got my dusting wand I wish y'all could see my dusting wand is hanging there and then over here I have my Norwex mop with the pads hanging next to it I love this and now I don't have to I can get everything I need without having to fight for anything else so I know the lighting is bad, so I'm gonna try to show you what I've got here. Okay, so again, this didn't really change. I just I did go ahead and put my extra um, uh, body washes and shampoos and hair gel in here with the toothpaste. Okay, this is where I've got my extra soaps, my um, dish, dish liquids. Here I have my extra hand soaps. This is just my cleaning caddy, which I'll be doing a video on this shortly, but this, uh, it's just things that I use to do general cleaning. That way I can take it all with me. It's got gloves, I've got a toothbrush, some extra um, uh, garbage bags in there. And then these are cleaners that I use sometimes. I don't use these in my regular cleaning. These are like my specialty uh, items. Um, over here I have my extra Kleenexes. Um, this is just where we have some extra tools. And of course, like I said before, that's where we keep our toilet paper and our um, extra paper towels. So yeah, I think this looks great. Definitely a lot more functional and it's cute. So thanks for hanging out with me while I got my closet organized. I'm happy with it. I can find everything and I'm so glad to have the ironing board out of there. Um, anyway, that's all I've got for you guys today. Until next time.